welcome back. This is Bella Scoopa with a super powered episode of Let's Play Secret of Mana. I'm joined as always by our champions, Jake, Shion, and Yancey. When we last left off, I just did a magic special. However, this time, I'm going to be going through the end of the game again with my super powered party. Uh, my super powered party, I must admit, is uh, due to me cheating. Um, I, I, I don't want you guys thinking I did this legitimately. I, I didn't have time or patience, to be honest with you, and I'll go over why in a second. Um, so, Jake is level 99. Everything is max. Um, his strength, uh, and those are his max stats. Anything higher than those, and other people are cheating much, much worse than I ever did. I just I just cheat to save time. That is all. Uh, let's take a look at Xion's stats. Xion, of course, uh, only has 800 HP, but does have 99 MP. Uh, she does not have strength or agility or constitution nearly as high as Jake, but her wisdom is very, very high. Uh, that, of course, is for white magic, heals, buffs, that kind of stuff. Her intelligence, which is also pretty damn high, especially compared to Jake's, is for the black magic that Yancey uses. Uh, she does have a couple offensive magic, so that, that would probably go off of that stat. Her attack is pretty pretty high, but lower than where uh, Jake's was. Her, her hit percentage is down. Uh, defense and magic defense, pretty standard across the board. Not, not much variation between them, I must admit. Now it's time to look at Yancey's stats. Here we go. Uh, level 99, once again. Uh, HP of 800, MP of 99. I had to, to kill the Dread Slime. That's why it's 99 MP there. Strength sucks with Yancey. Uh, Yancey is not supposed to be a physical attacker, as you can clearly see here. Intelligence, max. Wisdom, not so much. Attack, low. Uh, defense and magic defense. Uh, considering the range of how high that, that bar should go, you would think that p there'd be a wide variation between defense and magic defense, but as far as I can tell, you know, not more than like 10 or 20 between my party members, and we're up at 550, so kind of strange. Kind of strange. All right, uh, that's not the only thing that I've been doing, getting people up to level 99. I've also been doing weapon level grinding. Uh, you did see my magic grinding from before, but now it's time to show off the weapon grinding that I've been doing, and this is pretty much the real reason why I cheated um, because in order to get the last orb and in some cases the second to last orb of all these uh, weapons you do need to get a pretty much one out of 200 drop so hooray that, that I, I'm I don't have the patience for that, I'll be honest with you. Uh, let's take a look at them, though. Uh, the highest glove is the Aura Glove. In order to get the last two orbs for this, you need to get them off of Wolf Lords here in the Mana Fortress. Of course, the Dragon Buster is what I got in the normal playthrough. Uh, pretty much, you can't level this up any further, which is why it is at 8-0, which is the max weapon level you can get legitimately in the game. Uh, there is a way to get the sword's ninth, sorry, eighth orb uh, to get it up to level nine, which is the mana sword. Um, pretty much you have to do a soft reset, play, the, play a new game until you get that first sword's orb, then reload your save. There's, there's all these details on, on how to do it online, so uh, I've never done it myself. So I, I don't want to, you know, try to give it too definitive for you. Uh, but you have to save in a certain location, and there's all this stuff that you have to do in order to get it to work. But I have seen it work. Uh, if if you're lazy though, you can Game Shark the orb in, uh, and Watts will do it for you, no problem. Uh, do Max. Oh, if you're curious of, uh, as to what all these descriptions are, it just says the top whatever. Um, Except for the Dragon Buster, which is effective against dragons. Everything else is, you know, the top axe. Uh, the highest axe is the Doom Axe. You have to get two axe orbs from the Fiend Heads here in the Mana Fortress in order to get that one up all the way. Uh, next, we have the Daedalus Lance, the top spear. If you want to get that spear, you got to get a Spears Orb from the Tsunami here in the Mana Fortress. 
Next we have the whip, the Gigas Flail. In order to get that last whip sword, you need to get it off a Terminator. Uh, once again, here, all of them are here in the Mana Fortress. Uh, next we have the Garuda Buster, the top bow. You can get that last orb off of Metal Crabs. Then we have the top Boomerang, which is a Ninja's Trump, which is a Shuriken. You have to get that off the Master Ninja, like you might expect. The Ninja's Trump comes from the Master Ninja. Next we have the Valkyrian, the Javelin, the top Javelin. You can get those off of Wimpers here in the Mana Fortress. In terms of what Shion has, she does have the gloves, lance, sorry, spear, uh, whip, bow, and boomerang all the way up. I forgot that she wasn't on the javelin for a little bit, so she does have a little bit of weapon skill there, uh, but not too much. She, of course, does have everything maxed on the magic like we went over last time. For the record, $8.99 for weapons means nothing! Uh, level 8 does mean something. Uh, it does give you the chance to charge up your attack all the way up to level 8. Any point, the, the, any point in grinding after that is completely for your own personal satisfaction. There is no practical purpose to leveling them up past 8 colon 0. But I did it anyway, because I had cheats for it. Next we have Xion, or not Xion, we have Yancy, uh, who has, of course, uh, 899 on the whip, bow, boomerang, and javelin. I'm forgetting their default names sometimes, and of course, 899 across the board on magic 899, as I went over in the last video, is important when it comes to magic. Now, I think, oh no, we are not ready to move on. I have more to go over. Uh, we have to go over armor. So, Jake is on the Griffin Helm. That is the best thing that he has. It gives him 145 defense. You can get those off the Griffin Hand in the Pure Land. Um, also, what I call the Chicken Foot over in the mana, for mana Forest. So, that is where you can get that. And that gives him plus 5 strength and plus 5 agility by equipping that. Uh, the Fairy Crown, as... Well, you can't really see. Xion and Yancy, that is the best thing for them. It gives them plus 5 intellect or intelligence, whichever one it is. I can't remember. You can get them off of uh, Terminators in the Mana Fortress, and they give you 150 defense. Next, we have uh, the Power Suit, best body armor for Jake in the game. You can get these off of Wimpers in the Mana Fortress. They give him 245 defense and they give him plus 5 strength. Then for the Sprite and the girl for Xion and Yancy, uh, you have the Fairy Cloak, which gives them plus 5 constitution, 250 total defense, and they can be found off the Master Ninjas here in the Mana Fortress. And finally, we do have everybody on Fairy's Rings. It does uh, 100 base defense. You can find them off of Wolf Lords here in the Mana Fortress, and they make you immune to Poison, Pygmy, Frosty, Dizzy, and Balloon, and they give you plus 5 agility. Whew, okay. That is, as far as I can tell, <laughs> the best setup in the game as far as uh, armor in terms of weapons. You know, that's really up to your, your discretion. I would probably recommend not having any um, overlapping characters when it comes to we weapons. For instance, I have uh, both Xion and Jake on the spear. Uh, looking back, I probably would not have done that. But uh, we are ready to move on. I didn't, I didn't want to just do the last battle for this one because uh, the last battles are, of course, almost primarily done with magic in this game. That seems to be the best way to get this done. And I wanted to show off that pretty much even at level 99, I cannot one-shot the enemies here in the Mana Fortress. And if you saw the, uh, the magic special, the magic showcase, there are definitely times when I can even kill everything with one hit in the Lofty Mountains. Uh, physical attacks don't 
really level up that much. I can level everything up to, uh, charge everything up to, uh, level 8, uh, which I will do once Xion can get past that freaking thing. Alright, let's level up to level 8 so that we can at least see the attack animation that we can get from that. And I'll try to do that for each weapon if I can. It does take a while for that to load, though, unfortunately. All right. Let's see what we can do against the Terminator here. 659. That's not bad. Okay. Now we can switch again to... Wrong way. There we go. Switch to the sword, which I still can get up to level 8, even though... Uh, it's not up to 899, and we don't have it maxed out in terms of, um, its level. We can still get the charge of the attack up to level 8, and then really engulfing cancels that out. Even more reasons to hate physical attacks in this game, I'll be honest. And as you can see, by the time I get up to level 8, they've already killed every enemy on this floor. So I did not lie to you when I said, even though that most guides tell you to get everything up to level 8 to charge your attacks in order to kill things, it is more efficient for you to just attack using the normal attacks. Now, nothing is really going to respawn here. Are you kidding me? The one time I want something to respawn, nothing? Like, I went through this whole dungeon. Things respawn here. Are you kidding me? Now that I've got it up to level 8, no. You you are a giant troll game. Do you know that? Finally get a chance to show off the way I'm supposed to do this game. And you won't give me the time of day. Actually, it shows it off anyway, doesn't it? So, there you go. You don't see how much damage it does, but that's really up to the enemy that we're up against. Alright, let's show off the gloves. Since I'm here and we're, we're, we're going to keep moving forward while I do this. Hopefully something does spawn along the way so I can at least show off. Nope. Nope. Of course not. Alright, here goes the attack. That is an insane attack. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the other side here. Alright, let's see. I think I can just show off with, uh, with Yancey and that will get the other four. So I don't need to do anything with Xion. Xion, you're not going to be doing anything for me here. And of course, because I, I'm using Yancey, the uh, the total damage is going to be down. But that's to be expected. Are you kidding me? Because Yancey was in the middle of a backflip, it canceled. So many things cancel these charges. That's... Uh, I, I try to show things off. I try. The game makes it difficult. Okay, hit the fiend head. That is a lot of whipping that you got going on there. Now we can show off the bow. And that's uh, five things so far. <laughs> oh, God. We can do this, though. We can do this. I want to show off the max level attacks. Okay. Hit him. You fired two arrows. That's the best you got? That is the best you got. Alright, let's charge up the boomerang. Let's charge. Yeah, still can't one shot. I'm still doing roughly the same amount of damage as far as I can tell. <laughs> you know, just over a hundred. Alright, Terminator! Die! You, you threw two! Okay, last one. We got the javelin. Let's see what the javelin can do. Fully powered up! Fully charged! Ready to go! Give me an enemy to kill! There's a wolf! I, I'll i take a hackhound. I'll take him. I don't know if I'm going to be able to hit him, though. I'm not very good with the javelin. Alright, there we go! So, front flip, double throw. And that's pretty much it! That's, that's what you can do with this. Uh, let's switch back to something that's good. And you can switch back to... I don't need the whip anymore, so you can stay on that. We can stay on that. And then we're good. But as you can see, even leveling things up all the way, perfect party, max attack as far as these characters can go, leveled up as high as I can go. I can't one-shot them. I, I am making this a little bit easier for myself, but 
overall, I'm, I'm not seeing that getting up to level 9 is necessarily worth it in this game, if I'm being purely honest. Um, I, I, this is one of the times when, in most games, I would love to show off, hey, look how overpowered I could be, how easy everything becomes when I'm so completely overpowered. But to be honest, I'm not seeing that much of a difference here. Wait, Mr. Ninja dropped a treasure chest. No, 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 no. Grab it. Okay, obviously it's not going to be the axe or whatever orb he had. I can't remember. Oh, he had the, the boomerang orb because it's the, the ninja. Uh, but he does have fairy cloak, so that's that's pretty standard as to what you can get. All right, I am done showing off the weapons. You can, you can clearly see that my point has been made. So let's just boogie on down as I kill that guy. This room... Where the hell? See, now this guy respawns out of nowhere. I don't even make it off the screen for more than like three seconds for this guy. And he... Xion. Damn it, Xion. See, now I have to kill this guy. Otherwise, Xion can't make it... Or, thank you, Xion. She finally does make it around the corner. And then there's a Terminator. Once again, I'm in that same freaking room. But I go like two screens off and nothing spawns for me. Isn't there... Isn't this the end? Damn it. You guys can make it past this guy. It's not that big of a problem. Come on. Yeah, even at this level, max level, and you're supposed to do this at pretty much half the level. If you're at, like, level 50, you can beat the game. It's, it'll be a little tough for you, but you can beat the game at level 50. Uh, level 60 is pretty, pretty much the standard as to when you can beat this game. And I'm level 99. You know, there's no level 100. And I'm still having a little bit of difficulty taking these guys out. Especially when they cast Lucid Barrier on themselves. I don't have Dispel Magic on me. Alright, let's just step on there. And we are finally ready to take on the boss yet again. So I can show off how much damage we can do against him. There.